2018, my dad passed away from colon cancer and kind of that spring, my mom wanted me to get out the house and do something, you know, instead of hiding in my room all day, as she called it. Um, but so she made me go to the 412 uh, and I just remember my first time being there, like, it just kind of felt like a family, you know, like you just know when something's right. And uh, I remember Pastor Keith walking up to me and he brought a bunch of leaders and I remember them just like standing around me and like just praying over me to help me through the situation that I was going through with my dad passing and everything. After that, I just knew that that was going to be a good place for me to stay and kind of just call my family away from family, you know? Uh, actually, this summer when we went to Camp Harvest with the 412, I, for a long time, I've struggled with self-worth and how could, you know, God love me for all the things I've done because I used to be, used to be a bad person, you know? I remember for the longest time I had a two-year pornography addiction. Uh, I mean, you could probably imagine, you know, being a teenage boy in today's world. Uh, yeah, I broke that with the help of the 412. I struggled with self-worth a lot, and then I can't remember her name, but she was from Rockford because we were with there. We were there with the rock group from Rockford, and I remember she taught on how God just treasures you and like finds you so valuable and like I just like the whole time I just felt God like saying hey this is how I feel about you I treasure you like you are worth everything to me you know it's been amazing to have somewhere where you can go and just hear the word of God every week you know and especially since it's in Wednesday it's like the middle of the week it's almost like like Pastor Ross was saying a five hour energy shot you know in just the middle of the week that just kind of helps you keep going and just be stronger in your faith of God. Yeah. And it's nice to have friends that share the same faith with you, you know, to talk to with all your problems and your issues. You know, we're always looking for new people to come to the 412. It's changed my life. And I know other people that has changed their life too. And I think anyone sixth to 12th grade should come and try it because it's like a family there and it's the only way I can describe it, it's just a family.